Hey, this is Duct Tape Crafts 1. Um, this video is just going to be a, a little haul um, and two new prototypes that uh, I'm pretty sure no one's made. At least I know one of them no one has made because it's like my creation. I was just sitting here playing around and I just thought of it and I was like, bam, I mean, um, it's not really like a, that's blood from my finger, I was bleeding, but anyways, um, it's not really like a boy type, more, one could be a boy or a girl, but one is more like a girl, but I could do it in boy colors, but like boys could put, I don't know what they could put in it, but they could find something to put in it, but first I'm going to start off with the one that could be boys or girls, so like, you're just wondering, it's, you know, simple bifold wallet, la la, whatever, little ID card pocket with not so good plastic because I don't have good plastic. Uh, you know, you just got three card pockets, one, two, three, good fold. But when you turn it to the back, there's like this little pocket right here. And there is no photo lines on this and the buffalo. So like, it's a velcro. And you bring it down. And I could do this in any different colors. But when you bring this down, you have a easy accessible um, business card card slot. Um so either you could buy the single card slot or you could add two dollars to a bifold wallet to get a flip down card slot. So yeah, these are your options on this. I can put two down here and probably one up here because of the Velcro. Or I could use, that's one way, that's the only way you could do on the pockets, one up here or one down here or two down here and this just be blank. Um, or I could use magnets on this, but I don't have the extremely strong magnets. So yeah, uh, this is it. And actually, I mean, you can't really tell that there's something back there unless you do it like that. So yeah, this is my own little design that I came up with with a flip down business card with a bell fall, three card pockets and I did. And it's still, I mean, besides that, it's like a regular wallet. Um, so yeah, there's that one. And this one I actually just got down through making. It isn't really all pressed that yet. That pressed, I haven't pressed it yet, but it's like a, like a little box, like a little treasure chest kind of type deal with a bow on it. And the bow is like bobby pinned down. Then you have like a magnet strap. Then you have like the sides. And then you just have like a little, um, like a little stuff you could put like makeup or something like that in on the go. I don't know, I don't really wear makeup, I haven't ever worn makeup, so yeah, <laughs> I don't know. Um, but yeah, it's just a little simple box. And I come up with this on my own too. I was just sitting here in the kitchen just playing around, uh, thinking about some stuff. I really, I see a lot of people making like new kinds of, um, like their own little stuff that they come up with. So I was just sitting here thinking, I was like, yeah. Cause at first it's just gonna be a mini bag like one of my little mini bags and I keep holding these down because I gotta press them down somehow. I don't know how to keep it down like that. But uh, yeah, I was like, man, what could I do? What could I do? So I thought of it and I was like, yeah, that that's what I could do. I just put it together and put a ball on there with the bobby pin and actually you can't see the bobby pin on the other side. So yeah, pretty good idea, huh? So yeah, please just comment below let me know what you think about this. If you want to order this, um, it's probably going to be like five or six dollars, depending on the, like, you could have any colors you want, like, the bow could be different, and I did like a polka dotted bow with it, and I just, I mean, this, this, this looks really good on this. The colors look, I think, look really good. But, um, so yeah, thumbs up this video. I know this is kind of girly. And I, I'll think of something boyish kind of type. Uh, you, sorry, that's my dog. You hear getting water in the background. Sorry. Um, but anyways, so yeah, this is pretty much it. Um, 
Now I'm going to, what did I do with that? Oh, sorry. <laughs> now I'm going to move on to my haul. I have like, I haven't punched them out yet, but my mom got me some, I don't know if you can see them on there or not. Like, it's like uh, A through Z and 1 through 10, or 1 through 9. Um, and then I have the mini ones for mini letters. My mom found them at Kmart. I think they were like $7. And it came with a pencil and an eraser. So, yeah. Um, I have like A through Z. Now, like, there's so many on here and so many on here. And then on one of them, I'll try to find it real quick. Like, I'll, I'm pretty sure you can't see. But, like, there's like little, um, I can now do like, uh, circles, complete circles, squares, hearts, the peace sign. I haven't punched them out yet, like an oval, a moon, uh, like a little star, a paint spider type deal, an arrow, a, another star, like a, I don't know what that is, like a little pointed kind of type deal and a triangle. Oh, and, a, and like a swirly deal down here, circle, something right there. I mean, I don't know if you can see that, but I'll punch them out and put them in a video. So, yeah, now I'm going to move on to my other stuff. I got bobby pins tonight for, like, bows and stuff like that and what other creations I might think I could come up with to use this. I got another roll of duct tape, clear duct tape that was $1.50. Um, I got some adhesive magnet strip tape so yeah i got some of that actually i got two of them yeah adhesive magnet strip tape um i got these little 18 count magnets these aren't the strongest but this is all my walmart had so yeah i thought i mean it's pretty strong but they're not like extremely strong this is what i would put in a wallet if you wanted magnets in a wallet because like, let me see, like, so like, I don't know if you can hear that or not, but like, it's kind of, so yeah, that's, I don't know if that could, if you could really tell how strong that is off of that, but this is pretty much it, so like, if you like either of these creations, I did the box, I don't know what I'm going to name it yet. Also comment below on some ideas I can name it or some ideas I can make it look a little bit different. I'm thinking about like putting, like how I got these little flaps on the side. I think I sh I'm going to put one over the front and then have the little magnet strip right there. Um, but this is pretty much it. I got all this stuff. It's about bedtime, so I'm going to have to clean up. So, um, yeah, I'll be on tomorrow and I may have a collections video coming out tomorrow. So yeah, uh, I know I've said so yeah a lot in this video and I'm really sorry. Comment below if you need to tell me anything, if you'd like to order anything. Um, is there anything you think I should say, what I should name this one or this one. Um, any ideas I could put in anything, just anything. Don't matter. Give me feedback, please. Thank you.